Why are so many people essentially egging on the collapse of Western civilization without a clue on what would replace it? Yes, Western civilization has typically been very white-centric, otherwise known in scholarly circles especially as white supremacy, even though any more, and let me repeat, any more, it's not even usually about white people being superior, it's just white-centric. And Western civilization is also based around patriarchal and often Christian norms. There are obviously going to be a number of negative things about some of the standards, roles, rules, values, ethics, and customs that initially came from white patriarchal Christian norms. We should be able to focus on those things specifically, but still allow everything else to exist. Unfortunately, that's not what's being done anymore. It's what we were doing up until, I don't know, around 2007. I was really proud of the progress we were making. But then we changed gears, and by 2015, virtually all of Western civilization's standards, roles, rules, values, ethics, and customs were starting to be dismantled. And by 2021, when people were used to social distancing and masks, and we had the riots and more companies abandoned Merit and replaced it with DEI, the dismantlement went in overdrive. Again, it's all in the name of dismantling white supremacy, patriarchy, and Christianity. Not just get rid of the negative effects like we always had, but full dismantlement. And people have nothing to replace those things with. It's just destruction, and I simply can't understand it. They seem to have the mindset that destruction equals victory. You know, rather than having a goal of a solid set of systems that are easy for everyone to integrate and assimilate into. I've heard a lot of these people essentially stating that the golden rule is a product of white supremacy. The golden rule is about treating people the way you would want to be treated. You know, colorblind, genderblind, etc. But now it's white supremacy and other negative things. That if you don't see race, just the content of someone's character that you're a white supremacist, or you promote systems of white supremacy, or that you're privileged. To people who think like that, we absolutely are supposed to analyze and judge people on their race, their sexual orientation, their sex, their gender, and treat them according to how each of those groups currently declare they want to be treated, even when people fall into multiple categories whose group values currently clash with each other. We have to always be on top of and study everything group identity related and treat people accordingly or again we're you know a white supremacist or promoting white supremacy and a number of other things because the golden rule is white supremacy and patriarchy and cis heteronormativity and privilege the golden rule is apparently outdated and unsuitable for an educated public and as i think we should be welcoming to foreign cultures, you don't do it to the point where your brain falls out. And I see some people over-welcoming foreign cultures that they apparently know nothing about. And when some people from different foreign cultures have behaviors that are sometimes incompatible with the way that we do things here, uh, we're not supposed to say anything. We're not supposed to question it. It's just kind of weird. You know, we need to be able to tell people, hey, yeah, this is the way that we live here. It's as if all other cultures and all other lifestyles are preferable to our white supremacist patriarchal Christian norms. Because apparently we're a fascist country that doesn't let people live how they want or something, right? It doesn't matter if a foreign culture is far more patriarchal than ours. The misogyny will be ignored, and the culture will be put up on a huge pedestal just because it's different than ours. It's stupidity mixed with ideology mixed with people just wanting to be nice. And I understand it's, it's, it's good to try to be nice, but when you use sort of an ideological way of going about it, it can have bad effects. The people who hate the golden rule truly believe they're doing the right thing. They're promoting the right things. What do you tell people who think like this? Hey, you're destroying Western civilization. Stop it. And they'd probably say, good, right? I don't know. <laughs> and every time I've had any sort of significant opportunity to talk with people who truly believe in dismantling Western civilization, you know, or they, they just blatantly want it to perish. Maybe they don't even want it to be just individually dismantled and all this stuff. Maybe they, they just want it to be done. 
and I ask them, hey, what should replace Western civilization? They either offer no answer and put me on ignore, or they start saying a bunch of communistic things. Oh well, I guess I should just get out the popcorn and enjoy the show, right? Thanks for watching.